In Splinter Cell Conviction, Sam Fisher is back to suppressed headshot anybody who's wearing something that remotely resembles a guard uniform. You must hold right click to stay in cover. Oh God, that's gross. Why the heck is right click cover? Hold, right click, and then left click to shoot the thug. Okay, there we go. At least left click is shoot. They got that part right. Middle mouse is zoom. Okay, never mind. They don't know what they're doing. That's This is a very strange control scheme. The combat's not hard in this one. The real difficulty lies in the controls. Controlling the game is the real challenge. It feels like infinite ammo. It is the first mission, so that makes sense. Makes it really easy, though. <laughs> just keep, just shoot him a hundred times. One of those will hit him. Doesn't matter how big the crosshair gets. They'll die by law of probability sooner or later. Oh, flashback to his daughter dying. Sarah, do you like how I painted your name on the door to your bedroom? Hand-to-hand -hand kills give you the ability to execute. Press Q to mark your targets. Press E to execute your targets. Dad, what did you do to them, Dad? I got us some new wallpaper. The guy at Home Depot said the color was brain matter beige. Start talking, piss for brains. Get it, because I put your head in the urinal? Hey, the mirrors work, look at that. The mirror functions for the guy and for Sam Fisher. Can I smash him into the mirror? Sorry, bad guy. Your last words are gonna be inside of a bathroom. The last words I saw inside of a bathroom where employees must wash hands before leaving. You gotta make the vase shatter, right? Why did it make like a cartoon slapping sound effect? You can't stand in the light or the bad guys will see you. You gotta go to the gene timeline and put your grenades in Cinnabons. Sometimes. <laughs> Some, sometimes what, Sam? I think I cut him off by falling off the pipe. Ooh, shotgun, don't mind if I do. S is for shotgun, and also so much for stealth. I wanna slam this guy's head on the piano, make the piano go bang. Yes, oh yes, I love it. Where did Grim go? She's really good at hide and seek. Oh, there she is. Oh, you can't, you can't just sneak up on me like that, Grim. It terrified me. You missed. <laughs> That's how you do it. You gotta aim for the head. Okay. I <laughs> He's still going for it. Jeez, Splinter Cell. You're lucky there wasn't a piano in here, Grim. I would've hit you on that piano so many times. Can I drive the forklift in Splinter Cell? No, I can't drive the forklift either. Wow, no vehicles. Where's the vehicular gameplay in Splinter Cell? That's what the series needs. I wanna drive a Abrams battle tank with a suppressor on a stealth mission. Can I have your ammo, bad guy? Thanks. What the heck? That kills him, just landing on him? Okay, I'll take it. Only possible with the advanced physics engine of Splinter Cell. You know what else is only possible with the advanced physics of Splinter Cell? Dropping Anakin Skywalker's pod racer engine on two bad guys. I'm the master of darts, check this out. <laughs> That was the worst possible shot for darts. Man, good thing we lit this white barrel on fire instead of that red one. Who knows what would've happened if that one got blown up? Bicycle of a child. That's how you know it's sad, because there's a bike there. Oh, oh, there's two bikes. Oh my God, there's two children in this war? Now I'm crying out of both eyes. I want to win a teddy bear for my dead daughter. Can I do that? It'll help me a lot emotionally. Actually, she's still alive, I think. I think somebody said that in the cutscene. I want to win a teddy bear. They made a whole carnival mission full of carnival rides and games, and you can't ride or play any of them. Like, let me let me play the ski ball. That'd be fun. Oh, come on. Let me into the fun house. Let me into the fun house. I have to. I have to. I have to go into the revolving tunnel. It has to let me in. Oh, come on. I want to go in the fun house so bad. Imagine how great a stealth mission in the fun house would be. The bad guys are in there for some reason with guns and I stealth kill them. That'd be, oh, that'd be so good. In the mirror maze, dude, killing the bad guys in the mirror maze. They can make an entire splinter cell just in this carnival. There should be a part where a bad guy's gonna kill me and I grab the carnival gun and shoot him in the head with a BB and it goes through their eye and kills them. That'd be so cool. Subscribe to me on itch.io for my new game that comes out next week called Carnival Battle. It's just gonna be, you're walking around a carnival full of default assets and there's like a hundred different contextual kills you can do on stealth game guards. That would actually be the best game ever. Order here. Okay, what do you got? Hot dog for one dollar. One dollar, that's an outrageous price. Outrageously low. That's actually really cheap for a hot dog. I shouldn't have blown up that stand. I got, I'm kind of hungry. Knock the cans down. Oh, come on. All you gotta do is put physics on the cans. How hard is it to make the cans collapse? That, that's the easiest one in the book. Oh, what, well, come on. The balls in the bucket have physics. They can be rolled around but the cans won't fall over. You be soft, more like you be focusing on the wrong aspects of your software. What's he listening to? Oh, wow. The worst song ever. These are some weird pipes. Strange pipe layout in this building. This place will be really awesome when they convert it into a trendy brewery 10 years from now. Keep Poindexter here working. He didn't spell Poindexter right. That's not how you spell Poindexter. You can't use the word Poindexter if you're not gonna spell it right. Come on now, game. I'm all for increasing the vocabulary of modern military shooty man, but you gotta do it right. Oh, dude, they got the gamer room. I can record some audio for my Poppy Playtime. Let's play in here. Let's go. 
Once I'm out of the area that has the ski ball, now I get the grenade, great. Definitely don't give me a plethora of round throwable objects during the ski ball section of the game. Do I have infinite? Oh, I'm just throwing everything I have. <laughs> that room is so screwed, dude. <laughs> is there anyone alive in here? Yeah, there better not be. There better not be anybody alive in there. All employees must comply to the three S. S By the way, you're under surveillance. That's not a very motivational poster. That's a creepy poster. This is the most advanced government facility to stream Poppy Playtime from. That's why we use CRT monitors. Um, CRTs actually have a really high refresh rate. When you're playing retro games, it's better to play them on a CRT screen because that way the scan- Shut the heck up. You're gonna play Sonic and Knuckles on my HD TV with four seconds of input delay and you're gonna like it. Do I have a gun? No, I don't have a gun for this mission. Great, now I can't kill the guy responsible for using impact font for the campaign sign. I wanna know more about Megiddo. Copy that, Grim. I'll find out about Magneto. I think he can control metal. I think he's got like a magnet brain or something. Ooh, Phillips. Phillips sense and simplicity. They got a new light bulb and razor. Out of all the games to have razor product placement, I did not expect it to be Splinter Cell Conviction. How else do you think Sam Fisher maintains his per Perfect stubble. Hey Doc, I've been feeling a bit low resolution lately and low frame rate. Can you help me out? Uh, yes, Sam. Try leaving the cutscene and stepping out of the elevator. Oh, yeah, that's much better. Thanks, Doc. Sorry, guys. The mall's closing up for tonight. You gotta come back tomorrow if you want to shop at the JCPenney Super Saver Sale. Alright, let's see. Does New Zealand? Yeah, New Zealand exists. Nice. Interrogate Coben. Alright, Coben. Off the cliff with you. If I tell you, you're gonna kill me. Nah, don't worry, Coben. You'll be alive in the new one. I do gotta hit you on the table, though. And don't even think about hitting me with an American flag. Will the water machine Something spew water? It does. It has a little water poof effect. You wouldn't think I'd be able to work from home online because I have to stealth kill bad guys, but turns out with Cisco, I can do it from the comfort of my own dual monitor setup. Fuck me! Hey, 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 watch the language. It's a family-friendly YouTube channel. I play Poppy Playtime on here. Come on, I'm sure you can remember some information. Go ahead and take a stab at it. Brought over by Prentice! Prentice? I knew it was Prentice. I never trusted Prentice. Who the heck is Prentice? Look out, helicopter boss fight. Ooh, dodge a missile. There we go, that was close. Good thing friendly helicopter killed bad guy helicopter for me. I was not finding three RPG rounds. Hey, look, it's my daughter. Hi, daughter. Why did you come to the battlefield? Probably not the smartest move. Oh, emotional music. There we go. I'm so happy to see you. My daughter, who I thought was dead for 10 years, you probably shouldn't have come on this helicopter with me. It's never going to get hit by a missile and blow it up. The PMC is still doing PMC things. They just blew up DC. Step one, we EMP Washington, DC. Step two, uh, I guess we'll all go to the college lecture hall and try to kill Sam Fisher. I guess we'll do that next. Then really think step one would work, to be honest with you guys. That's why you don't stand next to burning cars, civilian. Vehicles on fire are likely to explode. I learned that one from Call of Duty Modern Up C. Bad guys, why are you even attacking the White House? What do you think you're gonna gain from this? I think the bad guy's plan is to kill the president and then that makes them the president. I think that's what they think is gonna happen here. Could be they wanna kill the president so vice president is in charge, but I feel like there's more subtle ways to enact that plan than blowing up all of Washington, D.C. When a random army shows up and kills the president, then the vice president immediately goes on TV and says, hey guys, looks like I'm in charge now. That's just a little bit suspicious. Hey, there's the vice president. Can I kill him? Oh, I can't kill him. I can kill the bad guys, though. Is, are they live right now? Are they airing this on CNN? Is everybody watching this epic shootout? I hope they are. The whole country will say, wow, Sam Fisher is cool. We should make him the president. Mr. Vice President, I regret to inform you that there is a piano over here, so you know it's about to happen. What? I can't leave the stage? There's a, there's a piano right over there. Let me leave the stage. You got lucky, Vice President. I wanted to slam you on the piano, but the bad guy stopped me from doing it. You got off easy. Rescue the president. I think Hillary Clinton is the president in this one still. Let's find out. Grab the bad guy. Okay. You're mine, bad guy. Nice try. I'm just going to go ahead. Oh, she's going to go ahead. Okay, I'll kill these guys. There we go. Nice combo attack. Classic bad guys. Always fallen victim to the old red dead dead eye when will they learn where's the option to slam him into the piano there's no piano option here i'll take the gun as a consolation prize but i'm not happy about it shoot him again sam aim aim for the head sam stop hitting him in the shoulder there we go oh stupid guards i'm trying to kill this guy now i don't see anyone else here but us and i'm sure you don't oh oh thanks hillary <laughs> hillary's like go ahead shoot him in the head I'm gonna go chill in Cedar Rapids and Pokemon go to the polls. Sorry, bad guy. I'm vetoing your election. <laughs> Splinter Cell Conviction. I'm not gonna pretend I played this as a stealth game. I just played it like Gears of War. It is a pretty fun third-person shooter. Every time you enter a room, you can see the exact stealth path they want you to take, so it's not, like, the most complex game. But if you just want to do some rootin' tootin' third-person shooting, it's a pretty good one. And it had slamming a guy's head onto the piano, so it's a great game. 